have a treat for you. Besides surf, the North Shore is known for its local produce, and a new restaurant called Kula Grill is at the Turtle Bay Resort, and it's highlighting the farm to table concept. And joining me now is Chef Conrad Aquino from Kula Grill. Good Hello, morning, good morning, Chef. Good morning, thank you for having me. And I wish our viewers you could smell, smell this. <laughs> oh, it smells so wonderful. Great, great, what are you great. making this morning? So, uh, right now, this morning, I have a uh, um, Hawaii Ranchers beef tenderloin, some hamakua mushrooms, some heirloom um, carrots. And I have here uh, tar some tarot puree. Mm -hmm. let's, yep. let's tip this up just oh, a little sorry. bit. And you've been uh, grilling this for a little while. For now. a little while, maybe about, um, maybe about 15 minutes. 15, 15 minutes. minutes. And all I'm going to do is I just pre seared it, you know, flip it over. I added um, my hamakua mushrooms. And over here, I got my taro puree already heated up. Your taro puree? Yep. So obviously, taro, what else that goes inside the puree? I got some cream, rosemary, and um, some, some garlic. Mm -hmm. And after that, I put it in a blender. And I'm just going to just plate it over here. And the interesting thing about the farm-to-table concept is that a lot of people have been really focusing on organic, but now yes. they're really focusing on getting things that are local, well, right? Well, yeah, um, at Kula Grill, you know, we try to um, s um, supply our products within a 10-mile radius. So over here, as you can see, we have some um, tomatoes from Green, um, green Growers, mm -hmm. which is in Wailua. Um, we have some arugula, which I'll be finishing off the dish from um, Kalea Farms. And, um, of course, you know, we, we got some hamakua mushrooms, which is excellent with this dish. And all I'm going to be doing is I'll be plating it up. I'll plate my tenderloin here. You want to help me hold this? Yeah, I will definitely hold it. Sure. Okay, I'm going to just spoon my veggies around. And, um, Look at that. That looks so wonderful. Simple, easy dish. And you can sub, you can sub this dish with um, your tenderloin with, like, uh -huh. chuck or New York steak. And Jill's been standing over here. Jill, why don't you come in for just a second? Well, You've got the fork. A fork for you. Okay, you got a fork. And I only found, found, one, I only fork? found one fork, but the whole station smells so, so good. good. Wonderful. And I'm just going to top it off with some arugula, with some olive oil yeah. and some um, salt and pepper. Jill, I'll let you do the honor since I'm you wrote the fork. I'm going to try this taro puree. <laughs> wait, wait. Because I don't have a knife. So <laughs> that's okay. Let me just... Uh, Look at that. That looks so wonderful. This is wonderful. just a red wine reduction. Mm -hmm. And give it a try. Real simple, real oh easy dish. Right across Delicious. the street. Thank All you. Right. Thank you. Okay, bring two forks next time. Okay, I mean, I will <laughs> the other one. <laughs> All right, well, thanks, Chef. Thank you very much for having me. And it's all at like Kula Grill. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Please calm down. Thank we you. We will. Well, still ahead, we've got our top morning headlines coming up right after the break. Also, we'll have an update on that barricade situation in Eva Beach. Taking a live look at traffic or at the Wall Street right now, This it is 647. We'll be right back.